Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you having a Toyota Camry. We're talking about this generation right here from year 2012 to year 2014. If you guys have one of those and if you have problems where the horn does not work, we'll explain which fuses you need to check, what else could be causing that, where you can buy cheap fuses and relays that way you do not waste your money and why it's important to test fuses and relays. All that guys will be covered absolutely free for your convenience. Make sure you stay until the end. So before we start, let us tell you a little bit about us guys. We'll be making a video for every single fuse, every single relay in that generation to your Camry and every car we get at the garage. Why we do that? Because many of you will need that information sooner or later. Let's say you need a fuel pump guys, fuse, or we need a steering angle sensor. Those will not be labeled correctly. You will have abbreviations that might say something like FI. You may not have an idea that's a fuel pump guys or fuel injection system. So that's why we're making video for every single fuse, every single relay to save you time and money. And if you're stuck in the middle of nowhere, or if you need to find a fuse, all we have to do, spend a minute or two, watch the video, find out the fuse, instead of guys spending uh, time to find it in the, in the service manual, instead of guys wasting money, okay, and time on parts and tools you don't need. Another thing guys, Every single car we get here at the garage, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. Those are our main YouTube channels. We have more than 1.2 million subscribers, guys, and we have more than 10,000 free repair videos that can save you thousands of dollars in free repairs. Another thing, let us show you something quick. You have, guys, some special fuses and relays. We're going to put a link in the description of the video below where you can get uh, fuses relays at a good price, quick shipping, that way you don't waste your money. You have those multi box fuses, we'll put the link for them as well, for different fuses, for different relays, okay? Uh, all kinds of fuses and relays, if you need to buy some and not to waste your money, we'll put the link in the description of the video below where you can get them from. Check it out. So, let's start on it now. So. If the horn doesn't work guys, which fuses, relays you will need to check in on that Toyota Camry right here. We'll demonstrate on a 2013 model guys. You have two different fuse boxes, we'll be working in one of them and that fuse box is right under the hood. It's super easy to access. Open the hood, this is your engine, that's the car battery, that's the fuse box here. You need to open that cover guys. The moment you open it, you will see a fuse box layout that will look like this one. Before we guys continue, let's explain why it's important to test fuses and relays. So let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses. Fuses, not often you can see if they're burnt or they're good. Sometimes they may seem perfectly fine, you think it's a good fuse, you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that uh, do not exist guys when all you have to do, test your fuse, find out it's bad, replace it, fix your problem. So we will have a video how to test a fuse, okay, different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys. We're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out here as you will need to check two fuses specifically in one relay this is towards the windshield side this is towards the front of your Toyota Camry you may have two fuses or one one of them could be fuse number 11 right here if you have that one and that's fuse number 13 that's the main horn fuse right here that 10 m fuse the relay for the horn guys okay if you come right here in that corner it will be that blue relay that you will need to check other things that can cause the horn not to work, okay, could be a bad horn, bad horn switch or bad quark spring, guys. With, uh, if you want to see how to test horn, we have multiple videos on our main YouTube channels. Check them out. Thank you for watching. See you next time.